Hey, this is Eric. Here's a video of me Stop playing right Fallout there. 4, which is just about the only thing I do right now. Uh, I posted some video game videos before, Calm and they're down. not very good, Calm and I don't down. say anything about them, and nobody really watches them. And Chill. I feel like they're just not very good, and everybody has so much better video game content on YouTube, etc. But it's mostly about <clears throat> what they do with it and not, Attack. you know, just random shots of games. Because that's really boring. And, <clears throat> and I don't think um, people really want this content from me. Uh, they don't subscribe to my channel for this. But I, I just, I love it. So I'm going to occasionally do it. Um, and the only thing more fun than playing a really good game like Fallout 4 is playing a really broken game like Fallout 4. So here's some ghouls that uh, refused to die and just picked up random dead limbs and started waving them around. Yeah, I don't know. I may just not do video game content. But I, for now, I, I just, I can't help myself. I have to show you some of the stupid things that happen. Here, I think what happened is somehow they got their limbs. I'm, I think they belong to that zombie and they, sorry, feral and they just got reattached to the model somehow. I don't I don't know how. This is a good one, so he basically just died standing up and I'm sure it's just some air condition. You see his his feet are through the floor. He just can't his physics has turned off because something even worse was about to happen, I'm guessing. Which is good, because, you know, physics is hard. And, um... Good physics is even harder, and most games that are in alpha, for instance, that have physics, when this sort of thing happens, then the model gets stretched out and starts uh, flailing and destroying things and, and doing terrible stuff. And the nice thing about Fallout is that the the kinetics of the characters do matter a little bit, like, you know, there's knockback, etc. So, it, you want it to matter, you want things to knock into each other, but you don't want something awful to happen when your physics starts glitching. So, I'm guessing what's happening here is it just turns off, and you get immovable objects. Oh well. Do I look like I want to chit-chat?